Aramaramka. Aramaramka is come from our reindeer people because there are so many. My mother came from that uh, Aramaramka tribe. The name of this is a. Sanistak the men fancy parka. And it never we use it for hunting or anything. We just wear it in ceremonial for a dress up. We have a good clothing when dress up time. It seems to me like we just own everything from the ancient times from our ancestors. We have a beautiful clothing. I don't know who made this with a very good shares, very even. This is a men's pattern. Women have a different pattern, men have a different pattern. They have a dyed, unborn seal fur, and they put them about this long, mm -hmm. and dangly things on the women. Everything is different between the male and female, the clothing. I think this is a uh, group. Makluk, we call it, virtual uh, intestine. And it took a lot of work to do that, and uh, when it just, we just clean the inside out, pour some water in, and take it out so many times, and then uh, we use our fingernail, thumb fingernail, to take the outer part off. And that, when it's done, we turn the inside out, and then we ran them, mm -hmm. and the water turns red, and we change it so many times, so many times. I told you, my grandma is too much for me <laughs> when I'm going up. And uh, until the water turns clear, and that she took them out in winter time and blow it off, and when they freeze, she just using her arms, hold on like that and tie them up and tie it up on the meat rack. And it stays there for a long time. Wind and coldness have turned it white. Christed Ocklet is a little bird about this big with a, uh, like on the beak there's those uh, orange colors and a curl up here like it has a ponytail and that's a Christed Ocklet bird. I'm Elaine, my Eskimo name, Siberian Yupik name is Ruktinga. Uh, it's a Chukchi name given to me by my relatives, uh, reindeer herders. They were reindeer herders from Russia. My clan is Kiwami. And uh, in Chukchi, I think uh, my name is Ruchtinga. And in our language, it's called Utuchtika. In English, it means came back. And uh, my last name is King Ikak. I'm from Sibunga, St. Lawrence Island, but I'm living in Anchorage now. The reason I, why I'm here is I'm here to repair uh, gut skin parka. It's uh, made out of walrus intestine with uh, ocklet curls. If it weren't repaired and left alone, it would keep on deteriorating, and probably that's the only one left and people from home wouldn't see anything like that again, only from pictures or drawings. This gut material, you have to have years of experience. When you're doing it for the first time, it, would, it made me feel like I was trying to sew uh, tissue paper. My stitch would be too big, too small, too crooked, or it would rip right through. Normally, if it was a newer one, like newer, still used, I would 
put a piece of uh, intestine on the inside and sew on to make a patch, like put that patch on the inside. What I'm going to do is because this is an older ma uh, material, I'm going to do uh, one on the inside and one on the outside and try to camouflage that and then I'll sew around the tear. And I decided to use sinew instead of a commercial a thread because it would be, the material is almost like skin. <laughs> from my grand and I dedicate uh, the repair work and the extra information I give to them and all the elders I could hear my ancestors speaking to me like uh, the memories in my heart like I hear them talking to my students yeah I want to pass this on it's best to pass this on.